Who is Dubai's richest family? Ever wonder what it's like inside the lavish lives of the crown prince and princess of Dubai's royal family lifestyle? Today we'll take a look at the Royal Maktoum family, the richest family in Dubai. It's hard to remember the Dubai skyline before the futuristic skyscrapers were built that we see today. The amazing architecture, shopping, tourism, unparalleled security, healthcare, and education make Dubai one of the most exciting places to live in the world. But this dream city didn't always boast the futuristic skyline and architecture that we see today. Dubai started out as a humble desert fishing village that was transformed into a playground for the wealthy and financial powerhouse of the Middle East. But did you know this incredible transformation of this city is credited to one man? Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum, the current ruler of Dubai and the head of the royal Al Maktoum family. He was witness to Great Britain vacating the seven emirates and he almost single-handedly made Dubai the city it is today by rapidly speeding up construction, innovation and modernization of the city. He also started Emirates Airlines and he is the owner of Dubai Holdings. His official residence in Dubai is the Zabil Palace, also known as the Sheikh Mohammed Palace, worth $400 million. And his net worth is reported to be over $18 billion. He's also got an impressive car collection, including a customized Mercedes-Benz G-Class, BMWs, Rolls-Royce, Ferraris, and the new Devil 16 car. Said to be the fastest car in the world as of 2020, it tops out at 347 miles per hour and it's worth a whopping $2.2 million. Sheikh Mohammed also has a passion for horse racing. He owns several properties abroad that help facilitate this hobby, which includes Dalib Hall in the UK, which is right next to Darley Stud, the biggest horse breeding operation in the world, which is also owned by Sheikh Mohammed. He also owns Gainsborough Stud Farm in Kentucky, which originally belonged to his older brother Sheikh Maktoum bin Rashid Al Maktoum before his passing from a heart attack in 2006. After his brother's passing, Sheikh Mohammed merged the two farms together, creating a massive stud empire. He also launched the 1996 Dubai World Cup for horse racing, but what can you expect with so much passion for horse racing? Besides his massive stud farm, Sheikh Mohammed also owns several impressive properties abroad, including 63,000 acre property in Scotland, worth around $5.5 million, as well as a glamorous La Belle Epoque penthouse in Monaco, worth a whopping $323 million. Not to mention the massive Yacht Dubai. This eight deck luxury mega yacht has room for 88 crew members and 115 guests. It includes a 10 meter swimming pool with two jacuzzis, a floating deck, and even a helipad. This floating palace is estimated to be worth $300 million. Sheikh Mohammed has plenty of family to indulge in these luxuries with. He has over 26 children from several wives, but he has his favorites. Dubai Princess Sheikh Amara bint Mohammed Al Maktoum is notably his favorite daughter. He's very strict with his other daughters, Sheikh Latifa and Sheikh Samsa even tried to flee the country but were ordered by their father to return. Yet he allows Sheikh Amara to travel, live and study abroad, stay in constant communication with her mother in Greece and even disregard Islamic laws. She is often photographed without wearing the head covering that is worn by his other daughters as part of Islamic law. She also likes to wear bright colors and spends money lavishly. Many Islamic women keep a low profile and are very rarely photographed in public without a head covering and even a face veil. But Princess Mara stands out among women in the UAE as she often has her photo taken with no head or face covering. Full makeup and manicure as well as changing her hair color. She has over 75,000 followers on Instagram where she shares her photos and lavish lifestyle. She has an estimated worth of around $1 billion. Like her father, Princess Mara is passionate about horses and she likes to have her picture taken often with her 11 horses. Her most expensive horse is estimated to be worth $3.6 million. She first started riding horses while studying abroad at Oxford in the UK. After she graduated from Zayed University and Oxford Aviation College, she relocated to Athens, Greece and continued to study equestrian sports. In 2009, Mara returned to her father's homeland of Dubai and she now lives with her family at Zabil Palace. 
where she works in trade and development, helping her father and brother further develop and modernize Dubai, Dubai and attend local events. Her mom is from Greece. Zoe Grigorico married Sheikh Mohammed about 30 years ago. After living together for several years, they had two children before their divorce. Sheikh Mohammed allows Princess Mara to stay in constant contact with her mom, which is unusual for his other daughters. When she, when she was first born, Princess Mara was named Christina, but then her parents gave her an Arabic name. Mara means female baby horse, which we find fitting for the favorite princess of Dubai when such a passion for horses runs in the family, don't you? Sheikh Mohammed allows Princess Mara much more freedom than his other children, perhaps because her mother is from Greece. He allows her to travel freely and use the family's properties in Scotland and the UK as much as she likes. She is an example of Eastern modesty combined with Western freedom for women. She's half Greek and half Arab, and her father knows he cannot completely control her life. Sheikh Mohammed even forced his favorite and eldest living son and heir, the Crown Prince of Dubai, Sheikh Hamdan bin Mohammed al Maktoum, to marry his own cousin. Yet at age 28, Sheikh Amara still remains unmarried and shows no signs of settling down anytime soon. Well, she may be his favorite daughter and possibly his favorite child, his favorite son, Prince Hamdan, is the most popular family member in the country and around the world. Known as Faz3 on Instagram or Faza, which in Arabic means the one who helps. He has over 14 million followers on Instagram. Prince Hamdan is presently the Minister of Business and Finance and Dubai's deputy ruler in the UAE with a $400 million net worth. Like his father, Prince Hamdan likes to collect cars and he has a golden car collection said to be worth over $59 million. This impressive collection includes a Ferrari, a Bugatti, two Rolls Royce, a Range Rover Vogue, a Mercedes G63, a Lamborghini, and a Porsche 918 Spider. But he doesn't just collect cars. Like his father and sister, Prince Hamdan is a passionate equestrian. He owns over eight stud farms worldwide, including Shadwell Racing in the UK, and he is a multiple world champion at the World Equestrian Games. Besides being an equestrian, Prince Hamdan also participates in many outdoor sporting events. He loves all kinds of animals and he is often photographed with animals including horses, camels, falcons, and his pet white lion, Frosty. But being Dubai royalty is about more than just fun and games. Both princess and prince are active in charity work as well. Princess Mara is known throughout Dubai for being a social worker and a philanthropist, and she is head of the Al Maktoum Foundation, which seeks to provide charity in the areas of education and special needs in Dubai and throughout the UAE. Prince Hamdan is founder of the Prince Hamdan Charity Foundation. He also donates to several animal charities and donates his royal blood at local blood drives. He even trains for and runs marathons alongside his countrymen in Dubai, which is a testament to the security of the country and the love the people have for their royal family. But that's not all. The members of the Maktoum family are frequently seen out and about in the streets of Dubai conversing and interacting with their people, sans security guards. They are known to be down to earth and humble. You have to introduce yourself. It's clear that the Maktoum family has the love and devotion of their people, and it's no wonder that they're the wealthiest family in Dubai. For more lavish lifestyle videos, hit the subscribe button now.